next in line. And, and Senator Tom Udall of New Mexico comes from a family of people who sought and achieved political office, including one run for president and a, multiple runs for Congress. And uh, Senator Udall is, was 11 years old when his father, Stuart, helped Jack Kennedy become the president and has been a friend of Teddy Kennedy ever since. Senator Udall, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. It's great to be with you. And we uh, talked a lot uh, this past year about you and your brother and the aspirations and uh, uh, the comparisons uh, with the Kennedys. Uh, when you see this and you hear the talk of legacies and dynasties and knowing your own history, uh, what do you think? Well, I, I, there's such a close relationship between the Udalls and the Kennedys, and I, I'm very sad on this occasion of losing Ted, uh, but he had such a wonderful life. Uh, uh, I, as, as you said in your introduction, uh, uh, I remember when I was 11 years old, my father was working very hard to get Jack uh, as President of the United States, and Teddy was assigned to what wasn't a really great assignment. It was working the West because there wasn't expected to be uh, much support for Jack Kennedy in right. the West. And so he came and slept on our floor uh, in Tucson, Arizona, and he was working and strategizing with my dad. And I have very fond memories of him then and, and, uh, and have had since then and have worked with him on mental health parity, worked with his son Patrick. Uh, we've had a good, solid, close relationship. And I, I talked to my dad yesterday. He's 89 and lives here in New Mexico. And... He, he just has such fond memories of Jack Kennedy and Bobby Kennedy and Ted that he just wanted me to tell that to everybody. You know, and that is amazing. We're watching you in the motorcade, and, and you've seen, I'm sure, on the television coverage, the crowds of people from all walks of life there. And we're also, uh, we also know that a memoir uh, was one of the priorities for Senator Kennedy. Um, just, to, again, looking back, was there any ever advice or discussions about the burden or the helpfulness of being a part Part of of American history, but in, in the sense of a political dynasty, as your family can so greatly identify with. Well, I we we don't like to to use the dynasty word. It seems and like I understand, that applies and more to, me, I understand more why to kings and all case. of that. But yeah, yeah. <laughs> but but, but uh, it, it's a it, it, it's a close relationship between two families, and and uh, I look forward to coming to Boston and uh, visiting with the family. And it's a it's a sad occasion for all of us, I mm. think. Senator Udall, as you know uh, so well, the uh, the cause of Senator Kennedy's life was uh, health care reform. And as we've all sort of been talking right. about the uh, the promise that he got from President Obama to make that a priority, um, there's such sort of anticipation and expectation about what these memories of Senator Kennedy and the body lying re in repose and the memories of him as a legislator, what is that going to do uh, to the big challenge facing you and your colleagues when you get back to Washington and that is dealing with health care reform? What sort of impact? do you think uh, Senator Kennedy's death will have on the tone and the nature of the debate and maybe even on wavering Democratic senators? Well, I think, first of all, it's going to create a big void. I mean, he was such a great leader. He was a great legislator. He pulled people together. He worked with all sides. <clears throat> Not having him there is going to be very, very difficult. But what I hope is that we're inspired uh, by his life and all of the work he did on health care uh, and that, that, that uh, we'll take this occasion and the impetus of this occasion to really do something great for the nation. I mean, they, they, we... This current situation is unsustainable uh, as far as health care, and we need to get out there and make sure that we get this uh, done for the American people. And that's what Ted Kennedy would want us to do. Well, Senator, thank you so much uh, for your time. I greatly appreciate uh, you giving your thoughts and even your, your perspective uh, on this.